So this is the Acer Aspire V13 at the Acer booth EFA 2014 in Berlin. This is a really interesting product because it actually shows us what the Ultrabook did to the mainstream market. $499, 13 inch screen, 1.5 kilo, running an SSD and quite a nice thin design as well. This isn't an Ultrabook because it doesn't have a touch screen I guess but it's quite an interesting combination of core SSD and a nice design. It's actually quite difficult to see this white on white here at the booth. But let's just take a quick look around at, uh, at some of the uh, ports. We've got a full SD card port here and power. I'll just flip that round to the other side and you will see USB, USB, HDMI and a gigabit ethernet port there and power. There's nothing on the back there, but this design on the back is a, is a metallic just engraved slightly, it's very, I don't know if you can actually see that, you might be able to see it in the light, but it's just engraved slightly with a little pattern there. It's actually quite attractive. So again, a little bit of sort of ultra, Ultrabook influence on there. Nothing on the back. So the version we're looking at here is a Core i5, U-series processor at 1.7 to 2.1 gigahertz, four gigs of RAM. And this one has got the hybrid hard drive in it, 500 gig hard, hybrid hard drive, but there is a pure SSD version available as well. Keyboard is has a reasonable feedback. Obviously you'd need to test that for a, a reasonable length of time before you could find out whether that was really good quality keyboard. Single unit uh, touchpad there with built-in uh, mouse buttons and um, looks like a fairly, uh, maybe not so sturdy hinge. I was just about to say that looks like a very sturdy hinge but that's just, just a metallic cover there on the hinge. So um, obviously at 499 built to a, uh, a slightly lower price, so of course some of the engineering may not be up to the standards that we've seen in Ultrabooks. And the display, yes, it is a 1366 by 768 non-IPS, at least it's matte. And if you're a single user, it doesn't seem to be too bad in terms of colors there. So at $4.99 for Haswell with SSD on a 13 inch screen, that's quite a um, powerful combination you got there. As long as that keyboard's working well and you're happy with that 1366 by 768 uh, screen, I'm just going to double check that. I don't want to make any mistakes there. It looks, whoops, it looks like 1366 by uh, 768. Come on. Oh. Yes, 1366 by 768 screen there. So that's quite an interesting product there, taking the Ultrabook down, bringing the cost down. Core based, there's a lot of power there, U-series core. SSD is gonna make it nice and fast as well. Four gigs of RAM, maybe there's some upgrade possibilities. It is a sealed unit, but you never know. You can always take that back off and have a look. Maybe you can upgrade the SSD, upgrade the RAM, and uh, make a really powerful system there. The only thing you'll have to watch out for is the screen resolution, 136 by 768, non-IPS. If you're happy with that on a 13.3 inch, take a look at the Acer Aspire V13. Looks like it could be a pretty good value device. Launching at 499, let's hope street prices bring that down a little bit less. We're at the Acer booth at IFA 2014. Thanks for watching. So the Acer V13 just about to be launched in, in the US. We saw this last week at IFA, um, 599 in, in the UK. This is basically an Ultrabook that's not an Ultrabook, but it's actually got Iris uh, graphics in it, HD 5100. That's not Iris, not Iris Pro. So you've got a good set of specs. It's a nice, tidy system. It's an SSD inside, U-Series i4158U, but there's the Iris 5100 graphics. So if you're looking um, for maybe a little bit of sort of low-end gaming on an Ultrabook style device, this V13 brings it down to quite an interesting price point now at $749 or uh, I think $599 euros. Obviously it's going to be different versions. Watch out for that screen. It's a 3066 by 768. So gaming on the go, go home. You can actually use this as a desktop. Just stick a decent monitor on it and uh, everything will be fine. Good stuff. That is the Acer V13 at IFA, at, sorry, IDF this week, 2014.